There are several scenarios that can occur where we would recommend that you make an appointment to come in and see a vascular specialist of Central Florida provider. Um, number one would be if you are self-evaluating your access, if you are listening to your access or you're feeling your access and it just feels a little different to you and you'd like us to evaluate it, please come in and make an appointment. Um, if you are listening to your access with a stethoscope um, and you hear that you're not really hearing that um, strong swishing sound and it sounds more like a high-pitched whistle, um, why don't you go ahead and make an appointment to come in so we can make sure there's not a blockage developing causing that change in sound. Um, also, if you notice that you're having um, pain or a cool sensation in your hand, any changes in, in your hand, you want to let us know. Um, if you're having any difficulty with usage of your hand, difficulty making a fist, if your hand feels numbish or cold to you, if you're having pain in your hand with dialysis, if at all you have an alteration in the sensation of your hand on the side where you have the dialysis access, that would be a good reason to come in and um, have one of our providers evaluate your arm and your access to make sure nothing's going on there. And if there is, if we do find something concerning that we can um, give you some options for treatment. Um, another reason you might want to make an appointment to come in would be if you're noticing any swelling in your arm that's not common for you, if your hand, your forearm, your upper arm are swelling um, on the side of the dialysis access, please let us know. Of course, if there's any sign of infection, if you're noticing any redness, any drainage, any open wounds, um, in the area of the fistula or the graft, of course, you want to make an appointment and come in. Um, if after dialysis, you find that you are having prolonged bleeding, um, the technicians or yourself, you're holding pressure and you continue to have bleeding after dialysis, um, you want to let us know. Um, that can be a sign of a blockage in the access. Um, when we catch that early, sometimes the uh, treatment is as simple as a fistulagram right here in our office that can be done same day or next day. Um, if you notice anything unusual about the arm or the access itself, the usage of the access, please give us a call and come in for evaluation. Again, often the treatments are very straightforward, simple procedures such as a fistulagram that can be done same day or next day right here in our office. And of course, if you need anything other than a fistulagram, we're able to offer you um, those types of treatments as well. We would really like you to know that if you are having any problem with your dialysis access, that we are here to help you. Um, if you are having any difficulty using your access, if you're being told there's any issue with the pressures during dialysis, please let us know. Um, if you're having any uh, prolonged bleeding after dialysis, let us know. If you notice anything when looking at your access that just doesn't seem right to you, let us know. Um, if you start to develop any thinning of the skin over your access, please let us know. Um, if you um, are having any pain during dialysis, let us know. If there's any issue with your hand on the same side as the dialysis access, let us know. These are all things that we can help you with here at Vascular Specialists of Central Florida. We'll do our best to get you in as quickly as possible. And often the procedures that are needed to treat many of these concerns can be done same day or next day. The sooner you let us know, the sooner we're able to help you out with whatever issue is going on with your dialysis access. The most important thing is to call us and make an appointment and um, we will get ultrasounds or perhaps get you scheduled for a fistulogram to get more information as to why you're experiencing the symptoms that you're experiencing. And if any larger procedure needs to be done to correct what might be going on, we're available to do that as well.